Hello viewers, welcome to our session today again. We're getting to look at uh, human sexuality and we did introduce what human sexuality is and so far so good we have looked at a number of uh, aspects in human sexuality but now today we'll get to look at responsible sexual behaviors, right? What is a responsible sexual behavior? What is the church or rather what is the Christian teaching on responsible sexual behaviors? Welcome all and let us learn. Your station is the Demo TV and your tutor is Roger Mchira. Now class, what do we expect by the end of the lesson? We do expect that we are able to discuss the Christian teaching on human, on, on responsible sexual behaviors. Christian teaching on responsible sexual behaviors. Now Christianity, Christianity teaches us about responsible sexual behavior. Now being responsible, what does that mean? Right now, this is the issue, this is the this is the this is the virtue of exercising self control or self discipline in matters of sexual behavior. Right, right. The issue of exercising self control or self discipline in matters of sexual behavior. Right now, self discipline is necessary when we have a relationship with the opposite sex. For example, when you are. Uh, maybe socializing with uh, a gender of, uh, of a different a person of a different gender. For example, you are a man and a woman, right? How do you relate, right? Now you must treat yourself with uh, discipline. Now look at what Paul teaches, right? In uh, can you get to First Corinthians seven nine, right? Paul talks of responsible sexual behavior. Now it is called responsible sexual behavior because it is obedience of God's command. Right? It is obedience of God's uh, uh, commands. Now, Christians promote healthy social relationships between boys and girls, men and women, husbands and wife. Right? Now, responsible sex is between a male and a female. You can't tell me you're having sex with a, with, with a fellow man. That's not responsible sex, uh, sexual behavior. Right? You can't tell me you're having a sexual relationship between a, a, a woman and a woman. Right? That is not responsible sexual behavior. So a responsible sexual behavior should be between a man and a woman. That is what the Bible teaches. Now, sexual intercourse is allowed only between married couples. Right? So all of those who take who, 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 who do uh, sex before marriage, we call it fornication. Right? So those are that's fornication. And the Bible strongly uh, 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 condemns fornication. Good. Now the husband should always fulfill the, mari the, 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 the marital duty uh, to his wife. That's the husband should fulfill the conjugal rights to the, 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 the husband, and the husband should always uh, uh, fulfill the conjugal rights to the to the wife. Now another teaching is that uh, married couples are obliged to be sexually faithful, right? Meaning adultery is not allowed. Right? So a letter is condemned even in the book of Exodus. It is condemned. Now marriage should be honored. Marriage should be honored by all means. And the marriage kept and the marriage bed kept pure. Oh yes. That the marriage bed should be kept pure. What does that mean? If your husband is away from home, you can't bring the, you can't bring another man to lie to, to lay you on, uh, on on your husband's bed. Right? It's not recommended. And also, as a man, when your wife is away, you can't bring a different woman and lay her on, on, on your marital bed. Right? Now, the marital bed should be respected. Right? And the Bible says that God is going to judge adulterers and all the sexual immorals. And sex, or rather, relationships, between a husband and a wife should be that of respect and faithfulness, love, care, mercy, submission, tolerance, and also forgiveness. All good. Now, class, for assignment, can we get to state ways uh, that can help boys and girls to lead a responsible sexual behavior? For reference, get to refer to Galbi, Galbi, Book 4, Christian religious education the third edition as always this is a link tv for your favorite learning channel where you get to watch and learn watch our more videos on youtube uh, the channel is a link tv and remember to subscribe thank you so much and let me see you in the next session